Hey what's up everyone, welcome to the Daily Jace where I give quick ideas around business to science to current events and everything in between. Today is Saturday the 10th of March 2018, check this out, it's beautiful. Um, so today I want to talk about the story of the week which was International Women's Day on Thursday. I think it's been such a huge year for women globally, um, mainly off the back of the social media campaign uh, hashtag me too. Um, it was all about how uh, women worldwide had been sexually abused and, and a lot of them hadn't come out about it for a very long time. Some of the stories were 10, 20 years old and so when a few women started talking about and putting the hashtag me too in their stories uh, then it gave a lot of other women strength to also come out and that was mainly off the back of the Harvey Weinstein incident where he abused a lot of women in uh, Hollywood and and that generated a lot of interest and, and it just got people talking about it and, and it made the world realise how big this issue actually was. It, it's nothing small, it's um, actually it's a huge thing individually but also as a society it's a huge problem um, because it impacted a lot of people. Uh, so I think that moving forward, it, it caught, be, just because of that conversation that was sparked around it, made people realise how how much uh, how much sexual abuse is out there so and whenever there's abuse um, whether it be mental physical sexual um, it's not a good thing so I think that it also sparked conversations on strategy of, of solutions which is a good thing so um, fixing the problems moving forward it's not an easy fix it's not a quick fix but at, because I think it's a cultural shift that society needs to take and there's a lot of education that needs to be made around it but at least these conversations are getting started but in terms of women and gender roles I think there's um, massive changes um, that are, are becoming apparent and uh, are also uh, are also in coming into fruition in the future so um, a prime example of that is leadership positions we have our number one leadership position going to a woman Jacinda Ardern she's uh, the Prime Minister and it just shows it's no longer an old white males game it's uh, it's anyone's game and I think whenever you have diversity not only with gender but also um, with race with beliefs with skill sets it makes um, it makes the dream work it makes people and makes teams come to a goal faster and specifically with genders I think both genders have um, just because of how we're biologically wired I think that uh, we both have something to contribute an example of this is uh, generally men have more testosterone which makes us more dominant and also more uh, more uh, uh, we're more likely to take risks because we feel that um, we're invincible. So um, because of this, uh, we can make bolder moves generally. Um, but on the flip side, women, they have um, less testosterone and that makes them more empathetic and they can actually... Um, connect with a lot more people easier and they can uh, they they're more inclined to work with teams and see the other side so um, there's huge advantages for both genders I think that everyone just needs to play to each other's strengths but also um, realize where other people might be um, better to come in and do uh, the role better so uh, yeah whenever you have diversity and the melting pot of skill sets it, it, there's huge amounts of research that you'll get to a goal faster um, so yeah I think that's going to happen more and more in the future um, so yeah bright future ahead for women worldwide but um, I just want to take this moment to thank all the strong women in my life especially my mother uh, and my two grandmothers they've been rocks in my life and I look up to all of them so thank you so much for all your guidance and support over the years you mean a lot to me uh, but that's all for today um, uh, if you connected with this idea in some shape or form then give it a like share or comment uh, and if you enjoy this sort of stuff follow me on LinkedIn Facebook or Instagram otherwise I'll catch you on the flip side tomorrow